Hey, Kai, where are you? Where are you, buddy? Oh, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kai, Kai, what do you think? Is baby gonna be a boy or a girl? What do you think? What do you guys think, boy or girl? If you didn't see that last video, uh, Princess is pregnant again. Time for another unboxing. Oh, sorry. Oh, no. Did it hit your toe? It's time for another unboxing with Kai. Oh, careful with that. Since I've started in filmmaking, I have wanted one of these. A flex light from Westcott. This is literally like an LED little mat and you can bend it, shape it anywhere. You put it on the wall, roof, ceiling, super light. Also mounts to this. This little frame makes it like a panel, which is really great. Okay, you wanna open this one too? Yeah. This is interesting. Another light from uh, West Scott. The Solix Bicolor LED light. This looks very powerful. I gotta test this. Should we test this? Ooh, Kai, look at this. It's pretty bright. Oh, don't look at it, Kai. Don't look at it. We can go tungsten or we can go daylight. Too bright, don't look. Daylight, very nice. Thanks, West Scott. This is Wow, that is that is at, that's at eighty percent. Oh my gosh, that's bright. Ooh, don't look at it. Don't look at it, Kai. Oh, don't look. No, don't look. Got it working, Kai. How do you like it? I I keep eating these Kai Pies. This thing is also bicolor, so it can go daylight or tungsten. I think we're gonna have to build this later because I don't. Thank you very much, West Scott. I very very much appreciate. It. I'll link them down below. May have dented the flooring just a just a little bit. Don't, don't tell mama. These last two boxes, I'm pretty sure I just ordered something. Whole box for this. It is not even half the size of this box. Come on, Amazon. But now I can I can dust up my uh, gaming slash streaming setup over there. But come on. Come on. This is a much much more reasonable size box for two bike blocks and some Velcro so uh, our cushions don't fly. Kai, look at the mess we made. Oh. Kai, do you wanna go for a walk? It's the best way to get him to sleep. Three, two, one, go! I'm gonna get you. Did you see worm? Yeah, they're not moving. They're not yeah. It's dead. I'm gonna get you! <laughs> oh, hey guys. How's, how's your weekend? I've been feeling really nostalgic uh, this last weekend. Uh, I was watching a whole bunch of videos back. Videos like, like, remember when me and Peter went on our first ever trip? I think we had met like two weeks before that. And we went on a trip to Italy and Switzerland. drove around Porsches. It was like, we didn't get paid or anything, but it was just like an experience that I would have never imagined that, that I would get to do. And it was all uh, thanks to Travel Feels, the YouTube channel. If, you, if you're new, you might not know that the channel used to be called Travel Feels. It really feels like we're going back to the old days. These last uh, like seven, eight weeks that I've been home, uh, I've been filming all of these vlogs myself editing them all i've been at home working like back in the day my home studio the travel fields days and it feels really nice I, I think what i've been underestimating or or i haven't realized is that i've been i've been making a ton of stuff but a lot of the videos are to Why teach you guys you something and i haven't been learning as much or making things to learn as much and now i've kind of just like 
I've told myself I'm gonna make whatever video, little movie, mini movie that I wanna make every single day. One that inspires me, a story that I wanna tell and not just what I feel like I need to make. Cause a lot of times when you're running a YouTube channel, you just feel like I have to make a certain type of content. I have to make more tutorials or more gear reviews or whatever it is. And uh, this whole COVID thing has kind of given me uh, a geese so wild it's given me an opportunity to just kind of pause and think about the content that I'm making more instead of just being kind of on autopilot because uh, sometimes you know if you do the same thing over and over again when you've made I don't know how many tutorials I've made it gets kind of easy it's not really pushing me it's not that hard I don't learn as much uh, like you guys probably learn a lot from them but I don't learn as much making them now I feel like I'm making videos that I'm really happy about and I'm learning something making them there every single video is like a, a, a different puzzle to solve uh, because you only have one day to film and edit it sometimes I have a plan but it doesn't go the way that I plan and so I, I kind of have this puzzle that I have to put together I have these pieces uh, and yeah it's just really really interesting learning about storytelling and just doing things in a different way than I have for a long time I don't know if that ramble made any sense but uh I hope you understand what I'm saying going back to the travel fields days sort of but not really it's like it's like I'm going forwards it's like a new chapter but I'm also kind of taking from the old Kai are you, are you gonna take a nap anytime soon no and I gotta say, I'm like really excited, like really excited. It feels like, I feel like I'm a bull in a cage that I just wanna like get out. I wanna go explore the world. I wanna make vlogs. I wanna start companies. I wanna teach you guys throughout the whole thing. I wanna make short films and documentaries. There's so much that I wanna do right now and everything's kind of on pause. There's definitely some stuff that's happening, some exciting stuff, but um, a lot of stuff is also on hold right now. And man, I, I'm just, dying to travel that's definitely part of the travel feels that i want to get back to is traveling more uh <laughs> kai kai what you doing buddy you want to go travel again too should we go to maui or what about norway i really miss norway i miss norway i miss 12. do you guys see the footage from norway uh we did a little family trip there like two summers ago, just an incredible place. If there's one place in the world you should go to, it is definitely Norway. We're just exploring with Kai here, trying to, trying to tire him out. It's a little bit more difficult than normal, but it is the most beautiful day today. I think it's the warmest day so far and there was, so I did like the short film competition thing, giving away $5,000. There are 1,952 submissions. That's a lot. Times three minutes, that's a lot of watching. Uh, and I do not have any extra time right now with, with everything going on and me having to take care of Kai and Princess right now. Uh, so thankfully, Matt and Tyler are helping me out watching them and kind of whittle it down to the top contenders. Uh, but it might take a little while. Just patience, please. Patience. Kai, are you ready to sleep now? No. There's this really cool carousel in here, but it's closed and it's really, really difficult trying to explain to a two-year-old why everything is closed, why we're staying at home, why we're not seeing all the friends and family that, that we all want to see. Kai, is it now time for a nap? No. Okay, Kai and Princess are asleep. That means I have about two hours of uninterrupted time. This is the only time in the day that I won't get interrupted, so I'm going to get some work done. I just woke up, uh, he's watching TV, but I had to come out A, because I needed a break and B, because it's, it's just beautiful out here. Also, I was just dying to tell you guys about the new baby. Man, I hate keeping secrets. So glad it's out, it's open. You guys know, don't have to keep it a secret anymore. Ever since I got home, it's been non-stop chaos.
especially this one. Oh, dad life is tough sometimes. Let us, let us.